And what I find so disturbing is not the treatment the children are receiving here, but the fact that the administration that created this horrific policy that basically the American people hit their American public's kind of moral gag reflex and forced this president to retreat from that policy, that because of his haphazard approach, there's not been the appropriate planning put in place with ORR, which has now responsibility for the children, to make sure that there's an expedited process to get these kids reunited with their, with their relatives. This problem was created because this president arbitrarily used power to put in place a zero-tolerance policy that the American people revolted against. And this president showed that he could change that policy with simply the use of his own pen. The good news here at Youth for Tomorrow, these kids are being taken care of in a clean and appropriate environment. They're getting the health care and the education they need. And the 15 children who were separated from their parents with this ill-fated policy have all been reconnected with a loved one. What I wish would, Congress would do, go back to the broadly based bipartisan immigration reform plan that was led by senators like John McCain that we passed in the Senate three years ago. Got 68 votes.